Hey guys, if you need coins on Madden Mobile 18 or Madden 18, make sure you still check out my sponsor, InstantMaddenCoins.com, and use my code MMG for 10% off. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another video. Madden Mobile 18 GOAT promo. So console has the GOATs, the absolute GOAT, Barry Sanders, right? So when I wake up this morning, I open Mad Mobile, I see all the gold, okay, okay. I see the GOAT packs, and I'm like, okay. yes! They finally put the greatest players of all time into Madden Mobile 18. So I scroll on down to sets, and I'm wondering, hmm, what kind of stats is the GOAT Barry Sanders gonna have? Oh, wait! There's no Barry Sanders in the GOAT promo! What the f- EA just disrespected you so bad. What do you have to say? God. Oh. Wow. Okay, Barry. I'm gonna need to censor that. That was wow. Oh my god. Okay, I'm sorry y'all had to hear that. Yeah, no, actually, the promo is awesome. It's really cool. I like the gold stuff. You can get a free, I think you can get a free 83 from the live event. So we're gonna do all of that in today's episode. Now, before we go any further, we do have a sponsorship today. And this one is awesome. I've been excited about this for a long time. So big thanks to DraftKings for sponsoring today's video. You should definitely know what DraftKings is already. But if you don't, it's number one for daily fantasy sports. You draft your team using your budget. And if your team does good in that competition, you win money in real life. And right now for DraftKings week, won a hundred thousand dollar contest you can win one billion dollars all of this starts the 10th at 1 p.m eastern standard time so make sure you check it out all the links are in the description and again DraftKings, thanks for sponsoring this video and i know i'm sorry i won't open bundles I, i'm gonna try not to i've only opened one bundle this year so we're good on that this is the second one i'm gonna i'm gonna keep slowing myself down and depriving myself that's why we have Wheel of Mobile. I never have to open bundles on Wheel of Mobile. But hey, bring back coin packs. I know they've been they've been doing this massive cash only packs. Honestly, packs aren't worth it anyway. They're really fun to open. So it's kind of like it kind of saves you, you know? Like you're saving coins and you're being a better player because you can't buy packs of coins. But it is really annoying because we had so many coin packs last year and they just don't have them this year. Either way, maybe they listen to us because we have 150k coin goat pack here now the goat pack has five enhanced gold or better players amazing right off the bat it has the whatever the gold medals the fragments and then it says you have a chance at pulling a goat player like i could actually pull i'm pretty sure 91 beyond in this now the other thing about this promo is okay there's my goat fragment um oh my god did i i got all trash golds in that first one that's what I get for the coin pack? That hurts, man. Well, the other the other thing I was thinking about the goat fragments, you need 25 fragments. And you only get one per pack. So even if I open the $100 bundle, I'm only 11 of 25. So either they're going to come out with a new way to get them, or it's going to be a long time down the road. Now, the other cool thing that that means is if it's a long time down the road, they're most likely going to add new goats and new goat bosses. So presumably, Barry Sanders will be a goat boss way down the line so don't worry Barry Sanders is coming I would be willing to put money on that all right so what I'm gonna do next is I'm gonna finish this Jerry Rice live event I'm gonna get my free goat Jerry Rice I get some gold medals as I do this so that'll be nice and then after that I'll open the big bundle and that's where we make the real money all right let's do this I was gonna say I'll get gameplay for you guys with any of these players if you wanted to vote on it but I don't think any of them are really gameplay worthy I think Jerry Rice would be cool but honestly, there's already a lot better wide receivers in the game right now. Like, I'm pretty sure that Larry Fitzgerald is, is you know, obscenely better than the Jerry Rice. So if I was going to get gameplay with wide receiver, I'd just do Larry Fitz. This is probably my least favorite type of live event when it forces me to throw to certain players. Because, you know, on sometimes on coverages, play, yeah, like right there, sometimes players just get covered. You know, and I can't really control whether they get open or not. All I can do is throw it and hope. And there we go. Got him in the hole. It's just tedious. The best ones are all the running ones, like rush for 50 yards or rush through the zone. Those are so easy to spam through. If you ever get a Madden Mint live event with like one of those with one of those live events that you can just spam through in like 10 seconds, just do it and do it and do it till your stamina is out, and you'll make like at the minimum 10,000 coins. Yeah, see like these. Ugh. Even if they're easy, these take so long. I know, like 35 seconds, right? So long. But you know what I mean. Her phone app, it's a while. What the f? Oh my. 
My teammate just cock blocked me. He ran his head into the ball and swatted it down. Dog, you're not playing safety. He could have caught it too. Okay, there we go. And here, just a simple slant route to JJ Nelson. Beautiful. Now these live events are repeatable as well. So if you got a lot of stamina, you keep leveling up. These ones are good to complete because then you can go into the sets and you can get your GOAT players out of it. So I like it. Free elites from EA. Now we just got to make a comeback with Jerry Rice. Oh God. We could have already scored our touchdown right there. But when I do these live events, I hate just kicking it back to them and letting them run the clock and call the timeouts. So if I can choose... I like to just run the clock out as much as I can. Let's go right here, just in case I somehow screw up. Okay, we're good. Please get that hit stick off, and boom, no time on the clock. That was perfection. We got the dub, and I think that's that's gonna give me my, my uh, Jerry Rice right now. I almost just said my Barry Sanders. Is it? No, Barry's that. Wait, which one am I missing? Run the route, I did that. Pass for 50 yards to your wide receiver. I did not do this one. See, now this one is going to be the one that you're going to want to spam. Like, this is the one that you're going to want to do over and over and over if you just want to get, like, mad. If you just want to get uh, your tokens as fast as possible. Like, right here, I'm just going to wait for JJ Nelson to keep running a little bit. I'm just going to throw it to him. 50 yards. I guarantee that's 50 yards right there. As long as he catches it. Okay, fine. And there's my 50 yards, and I can just play again, keep doing that same thing over and over and over, and keep grabbing my tokens. Bam! And there is my GOAT first win pack. First one's gonna give me the tokens. The second one is gonna hand me, is it gold Jerry Rice or 83 Jerry Rice? It is gold 75 overall Jerry Rice. I will take it. All right, so now we're gonna go into sets. I wanna look at what we can do before the fat $100 bundle. So you can trade in one you can trade a one gold player to earn a GOAT medal, and that's completable every three hours. I already did mine for this hour, but this is definitely a solid one to make sure you're ready for, because then once you get those GOAT medals, how many is it? Wow, that is a lot. So I've got 14 already just from doing everything that I just did, but 50 is a lot, especially for an 83 overall. Personally, 90 speed, actually, wow, that's pretty good. 88 overall with 90 speed, that's kind of nice. Might have to get gameplay with him. But I kind of want Ronnie Lott. I love Ronnie Lott cards. It'd be cool to grab a safety because there's a lot of good wide receivers in the game. And now, are you ready for the sellout? Dude, you know how, how Hitler EA is? EA had this pack at 100,000 coins. And what's funny is they said it was a mistake and I totally get that. But can you imagine if somebody was so amped to go buy this bundle and they were like... I'm spending 100k on it. Like, I'm gonna do it because it must be that good if it's $1,000. I would be livid if I spent $1,000 on this and then I realized it went down to 100. But then again, you had to be clinically insane to spend $1,000 in one sitting on Madden Mobile. So, I mean, I'm spending 100, so am I, am I one tenth insane? Whatever. Let's do this and I need to pull some absolute fire elites to make up for that first bag and it doesn't, it looks like we're not gonna pull any elites in this one either. We just get the goat fragment. Usually I'm looking, I'm looking for the shake. I'm looking for the little shimmy on my elite packs. Please. No, don't do this to me. Is this another one with no elites? Okay, I'm gonna cry. All right, it's time to cry. Hey, a punter, actually. I don't know if punters are worth anything. They sometimes are, so I could be happy there. Zero elites in, mom, help me. But like I said, guys, at the end is a two million coin player. Oh my god, I'm gonna cry. I'm hitting reveal all. I need help. Please! Somebody choose my packs because EA is not. Oh, we're on to pack 5 of 11. We haven't pulled an elite. This is actually upsetting me. Where's my elite? I know you're in here. Oh, there it is. Okay. The day is saved. The day is saved. It is also an 83 overall. Anything higher than an 80 overall elite is always super expensive. So, hey, let's get it. I'm an, I'm an excited man now. Vernon Davis. That's actually kind of might be a good card. 81 speed tight end. I like it. Drake Kirkpatrick. Ugh. Want to lead so far? I don't know how I feel about this. I'm getting the goat fragments and the medals. Dak Prescott, thank you. Dak, I love you. Dak coming in in the clutch. And we get a kicker. I am also fairly certain that kickers are expensive in this game. 78 overall kicker. I like it. That was a good pack. That was definitely our best pack by far. We got time. I'm, I'm hitting the reveal. Oh, hey. <laughs> Remind me never to do that again. Okay. And our final goal pack, we have full Shaq Thompson, Dak Prescott. End me off with Elite. <laughs> Muhammad Sanu. And if you guys know who Muhammad 
Shinu also plays for, he also plays for my Wheel of Mobile lineup. I don't know why I said that like that, but you know what I mean. I also have Sanu. And I get Joe Hawley. Okay. 81, Muhammad Sanu. So I pulled three leads. Yeah. Can't say I'm happy about that, but I did pull this. And this is money. This is literally the only reason that I was willing to open this bundle and pull these. It's for the 91 overall Deion Sanders plus one acceleration. He is actually, you're ready for the clickbait. You're ready for the clickbait socks. The best player in the game because he's the highest overall and he's the most expensive. Bah, bah, bah. Actually, can I say that? Is he the most expensive? I don't actually know if he's the most expensive. Presumably, though, he's also got 92 speed and he's the only player above 91 over or 90 overall. Actually, you know what? Screw you guys. He's definitely the most expensive. He's like 2 mil. I don't think anybody is above 2 mil. All right, so Dion at his cheapest looks like 2.4 mil. So if you got it, it's a solid bundle. It's a solid, like, I'm going to make money off of this bundle. You know what I mean? Like, I, I'm not reliant on those pulls. Because if I was reliant on those pulls, that is garbage. Gentlemen, that's going to be it for the video. In the comments, I guess you can let me know if you want to see gameplay with that Jerry Rice. I'd be glad to do it. But I didn't. I, I kind of figure you guys aren't going to want it, so you're going to have to let me know if you do. Uh, that's it for now. I want to get gameplay when a really really good player comes out and none of these are really striking me as that good so we'll see um that's about it for now guys thanks for watching as always i'm out of here peace